In this word problem, it says that Watertown received a total of 12 and 25 hundredths inches of rain over the past seven days. On average, how much did it rain each day in Watertown? Well, in this problem, it gives us a total of 12 and 1 quarter inches over the span of seven days. It does not say how much it rained each day. It just gives us a total amount over that seven day period. And we have to calculate how much rain it averaged each day during that seven day span. Well, they already gave us a total. So we're going to take that total of 12 and 25 hundredths. And we are going to divide that by seven to see what the average amount of rainfall was over that seven day span. Now notice in this problem we have no decimal in our divisor and only a decimal in our dividend. If you have a decimal only in your dividend, simply write another decimal directly above that. You do not move this decimal over to the right. The only time you move a decimal in your dividend to the right is if you had one in your divisor that you had to move over to the right. Now we are going to divide 7 into the number 12 and we can fit one group of 7 into 12. 1 times 7 is 7. The difference of 12 and 7 is 5. In the next place value, we have the number 2, so we are going to drop that straight down and write it right next to the number 5. And then we divide 7 into 52, and we can fit 7 groups of 7 inside 52 for a total of 49. And after subtracting 49 from 52, that leaves us with 3. And then we drop our next digit down, and that gives us 35. And now we divide 7 into 35, and 7 fits into 35 exactly 5 times. And I could write the product of 5 times 7 at the bottom, which is 35, but I know that's going to be 0, so at this point I'm just going to stop showing any more work here. So we would say that it rained 1 and 3 quarters inches over that 7 day span.